Hi Flag Pals! Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hello! My name is Brittany. I am a new dentist. If you're interested in learning about what classes I specifically took as a pre-dental to get to where I am today, a dentist, keep watching this video to find out. And I actually graduated in three years rather than the traditional four-year route. So I'll be splitting this up into year one, year two, and year three. And also I took some summer school classes as well. So really packed and that makes sense because i was able to graduate in three years well, the first year i also have I, I wrote it down here so that's why i'm looking down um the first year first semester i took general biology one general chemistry one and i also took a communications class which um was about media and society so that was really fun and the last class that i took was a mandatory class that all of the students at my university had to go to and it was a seminar type course and we basically talked about what made a good society. For semester two, I went ahead and did general biology, the second part, general chemistry, the second part, and I also took that same seminar class for the second part too, except it was a focus in society and fiction and film. And I think that this was one of my favorite classes that I ever took. We got to watch movies and read fiction books um, and kind of discuss what it meant, like how society was in those uh, pieces of fiction. So that was really fun. I also took abnormal psychology. Some schools, some dental schools require uh, intro to psychology or some type of psychology class as a prerequisite. So definitely look, definitely look into that. Um, so that wrapped up my first year. Then that summer, I really pushed myself and I did organic chemistry one and organic chemistry two. Now I didn't actually take these courses at my university. I took them in a summer school at a different university. And I would say that that was one of the toughest things that I had to do, learning organic chemistry in a summer, it's a lot. I'm gonna go to year two, and year two was when things got to get pretty heavy for me. Year one was a lot of, you know, general chemistry, general biology. These were all classes that I took in high school, especially taking them as AP classes. So I was really able to get that foundational aspect of it. However, year two was very difficult for me because that's when we ended up doing higher level, higher upper division biology classes, which really took a hit on my GPA. Um, so what I ended up taking for my first semester of year two was physiology, microbiology, physics part one. Uh, I took music appreciation, which was again, um, a general education class. And I also had a one unit honors class about creativity and knowledge. It was probably one of those seminar classes. I. I, I don't know, I don't even remember <laughs> what I learned in that class. Semester two was pretty heavy as well. I took anatomy, uh, physics part two, and statistics. I also took um, one of those honors one unit classes called knowledge and human values. So that was my second year. And then that summer I ended up doing um, an ecology class online, which was part of my university. And I also took sociology. Um, I actually went to England to study abroad and took a sociology class. So that was definitely an interesting experience. And also the summer during year two and year three, that was actually when I applied to dental school. So this was a very, very busy time. Now, if you are a traditional four year university student, you would most likely apply in between your third year and your fourth year of college. If you're currently a pre-dental student working on their personal statement or needing help on interviews, please go ahead and email me at contactbrittanywatu at gmail.com or you can check out my website, you can go to dentalschool.com. Now for my final year of college, um, the first semester I did genetics, histology and another one of those mandatory seminar classes and this was about what is an ethical life. I also started doing undergraduate research. I also did a senior project proposal class and a social uses uses of knowledge classes. Both of them were one unit each. Then on my last and final semester, which was really tough for me uh, as well, I took biochemistry, evolution, and those two classes were very difficult for me. 
Um, and I was also in another uh, semester of research and I was an assistant lab TA, assistant lab TA for anatomy. So that was really fun. So those are all the classes I took in college. I do have some regrets for my classes. All the classes that I took were essentially mandatory for my major, for my pre-dental prerequisites. Uh, they were either, you know, higher level biology classes, but there were some classes that I wish I definitely took. Um, I wish that if I had more time in my schedule, I wanted to take some kind of art class, whether that was ceramics. Uh, I wanted to take some kind of business classes. This is something that I definitely regret as a dentist. Um, we have to pretty much learn about business by ourselves, which is crazy. Um, I wish I would have took some fun classes. I really enjoyed psychology, so maybe more of the psychology classes. My boyfriend actually took an intro to acting class, which sounds super fun. I wish I did that. <laughs> I wish I, honestly, I wish I had a little bit more fun in college. Yes, I was able to graduate in three years, but at the same time, there were some stuff that I wish that I took. Like, you know, I feel like college is about exploring what you like and I, where should I took more interesting classes? Hopefully this video helped you all, especially those of you who are currently pre-dental students and kind of looking at your schedule and being like, uh, okay, how should I do this? See you in the next video, everyone. Bye.